Welcome to Modern British Art Gallery. Today, continuing our series on Sir Frank Brandwin, I have chosen to talk about a work entitled Working Photo Montage for Man's Ultimate Destiny. Brandwin celebrated murals for the Rockefeller Center, adorned the facade of the Comcast building in New York. This mural decorates the main atrium for the entrance hall. This photo montage is a preliminary sketch for the mural at the Comcast building, and as you can see, this was made by Brangwen using multiple grids so that the final image could be enlarged onto the final canvas. This cartoon shows the final composition in which the figure of Christ has effectively turned his back as in the earlier version of the same composition, the figure of Christ faces the mirrors. Picasso and Matisse were originally asked to paint the murals for the newly built Rockefeller Center but as they refused Sir Frank Brangwen, the Spanish artist José María Sert and the Mexican artist Diego Riviera were subsequently appointed. Nevertheless, critics complained that American artists should have been chosen for such a prestigious commission. Further controversy followed in May 1933, when Diego Riviera was prevented from finishing his mural. It had been discovered that he had included in it a portrait of Lenin, and sympathisers of the artist clashed with police outside the building. Authorities also objected with the bright and vivid colour palette that Riviera had chosen for his mural, as Brownwood and Sert had agreed to work on monochrome works. Eventually, Riviera's mural was taken down and replaced with another mural by Sert. Further controversy followed in September 1933. Officials of the Rockefeller Centre building objected to the figure of Christ being included in Brangwen's fourth panel. Raymond Hood, one of the architects of the building, explained that people were not comfortable with the figure of Christ being included in a business building. Equally, they were not comfortable with a single religion having such a strong representation in the mural. Therefore, Brangwen was advised to represent Christ only by a shining light coming from heaven. But the artist chose to merely reverse this figure. Christ facing the populace became nothing but a nameless cloaked man.